Nimetaka niangalie Ruto kwa macho nimwambie ai kale msano bluyai. I will vote no na hakuna mahali kanipeleka. Sawa. Eh hey, hii mambo ya Ruto kutishatisha wabunge I'm elected by the people of Kenya. I enjoy the same sovereign power delegated to me just the way you are enjoying the same sovereign power delegated to you by the people of Kenya. Na naongea kizungu kwa sababu mwenye kizungu hapo nyuma yangu. This is called harassment. It's not called taxation. Ukiangalia hiyo bill and I wish this must could have read for you. Yaani among other things, hata sisi mshahara wa tukata we have no problem because hata mshahara yetu huwa tunapewa wananchi. We don't have salary. Tumnajua hivyo. Kama mwingine kule kwa Musa goti yangu wanapewa wananchi. So sina salary ya kukata. Hata ukikata ya wabunge ya watu wakubwa we have no problem. But what pains us most ni kuambia huyu mama ambaye ako na chama. Kwa mama wengi sana zisikuwa kwa machama. Ati ukichukua pesa shilingi mia moja ufanyie biashara kutoka kwa chama inafaa urudishe zikiwa mia moja kwa sababu hiyo ndio katiba ya vyama chukua fanyia biashara rudisha ikiwa hiyo hiyo isaidie mtu mwingine ndio hiyo sasa wanazama hiyo mia moja ukirudisha paka upe serikali ushuru that is not an income hiyo ni pesa ambayo umerudisha vile zilikuwa there is no income Taxation is on production and income. If you have not produced, you can't pay tax. Tax is not on loss, it is on profit. If you want to increase the tax of a nation, simply increase production. Because it's a tax on profit. Lakini kuingilia haki wa mama ambayo waliitu wa mama mboga, Watu wa chini unatoa tax kwao. Alafu watu wa Tongareni mataka kale kwa nyamaze tu asionge. Tukae tu kwa bunge kama bungu, atimulileta Kenya kwanza. Ati tukiongea oh tume tunaingilia president. Mwitutuma kwa bunge tumfanye nini? Tuwatetee, si ndio hiyo? Sasa tukisema no to finance bill, mtakubaliana na sisi? Nyinyi mko na njaa ama mnataka mjengewe manyumba? Mko na njaa ama mnataka manyumba? Mnataka chakula ama manyumba? Sasa wanasema kwa hiyo chakula unakula wanataka waweke tax. Kama ulikuwa unakula ugali na umeenda wanatoa umeenda unabaki na ugali tupu. Ati wachukue hiyo cost of umeenda wa kujengea nyumba. In simple terms that what they are saying. Aje hao watu ni nyumba ama ni ni chakula? Na ukienda na kadi ya NHIF kwa kwa hospitali wanakuambia waitambui. Si ndio hiyo? Wengine wako kwa NSSF. If you have a a a a, 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 a provident fund, what you've turned and called it an investment fund to help the people in their sunset years of their their work. Alam bado kama kuna NSSF bado kuna pesa kwa wazee. What was the purpose of NSSF kama kuna pesa kwa wazee then? Hiyo NSSF ni nafaye pesa kwa wazee. Why? Kwa sababu hiyo NSSF imeibwa, haiko tena. That's why they introduce pesa kwa wazee. So hata hizi pesa za Lemi Housing Fund wakiweka kwa kwa kimoja, wanachukua hiyo pesa vile wanachukua NHIF bila wamechukua NSSF wanachukua wanaenda wanajenga sio hawajengi manyumba hapa za watoto wa watu ambao ni hali hali chini wanajenga manyumba kule Dubai they have i have information that they are already entered into contract with the people of Dubai to build houses there for the big wins in the government hiyo nyumba si ya watu wa chini ni manyumba za mabwenyenye wanajenga kule Dubai na nilikuwa nataka niulize nini mahakama nyumba yake moja iko one of those houses. That's why I'm at all. Because we must speak these things wananchi. We are in opposition to protect you. If we don't protect you there's nobody else. And a government that has no opposition inaweza umiza wananchi mpaka mkwe shakahola. Sawa sawa? Kama unachukua pesa kwa wananchi hadi wakufe Then there is no difference between you and the Shankahola, who is Pastor Mackenzie. There is no difference.